Hi everyone, I'm back with another plan with me. I am very excited for this plan with me. I feel a little more prepared than I was last week. I apologize for the bad lighting. I wanted to get a video up um, since I was already planning it um, in my planner. So, yeah, this time I'm able to do my plan with me during the day. The kids are taking a nap. Hopefully I'll be able to get this done before they wake up. Um, you may have noticed that I got a new background. I am so very excited. I went to Paper Source and it was my first time um, shopping there. I know I've been in the store before, but I didn't really like know what I was looking at, if that makes any sense. But this time I kind of had a sense of what I wanted and what I was looking for. Um, so, I got this background and then I got a second background. Let me show you guys that. This will be a plan with me and a little haul as well. So, I got the same background but a different color. It's more of a peachy salmon color with um, the gold accents. So, I love it because it looks kind of like distressed wood. Um, so, it's really, really pretty. And then I actually got, um, hang on, it's actually underneath my tripod. Um, okay. So I got these ready to frame art prints. And there's actually six different um, prints. There's one that says, you light up my life. Um, the second one says, you are braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. This one says, you are my sunshine, living the dream, life is beautiful, and you sparkle. You sparkle, you shine. So they're really pretty. I'm not sure how I'm going to use it. I don't know if I want to frame them all or somehow incorporate incorporate them into my videos as maybe a background or in my still pictures for my social media. I'm not sure. But I those were half off, so they were only like $4.50. So they were a good deal. Okay, let's get into this plan with me. I'm planning for next week, um, August 22nd through the 28th. I'll be using um, Paper Kiss uh, Mystery Kit. I previously used this for my personal um, planner, and so there's some stickers missing, but there's enough full boxes for me to do a whole nother spread, and I didn't use the Ombre Heart checklist, so there's plenty for me to do a full spread in my Erin Condren. And then I'm going to pull these date covers from Sweet Kawaii Design. So let's get right into it. All right, so I'm going to, I didn't use the bottom washi, so I'm going to put that down. All right, so I'm going to take out the full boxes, the headers, and the check, ombre heart checklist. Somewhere there. They are. All right, so I'm going to save one of the. Um, I think I'm going to save the pink. No. Yeah, I'll save the pink. Little hot air balloon sticker for the. Actually, I can't. I forgot. I have to use all of them because there's only seven. I might have to use washi for the thankful thought. Okay, so let's start putting them down. So who is excited for fall? I know I am. I'm excited for all of the um, shops to have sales on their um, fall kits. I started getting some fall kits, but um, I do have two so far, and I'm so tempted to get the Glam Planners kits that she just released. They are so beautiful. They're on pre-sale right now. Today is Thursday the 18th. Um, so, hopefully by the time you guys see this, you've been able to pick up one of those. But she came out with October Monthly View Kits, 
and then um, kits that match them. They are so pretty. All right, so, um, but I have to be kind of frugal with stickers right now, so I haven't been able to get it. Um, but maybe, hopefully one of these days. I think I'm gonna put my checklists um, in the middle. So let's put uh, today headers on the full boxes. No, we'll do tidbits on the full boxes. Yeah, we'll do tidbits. So yeah, Glam Planner came out with some really pretty fall kits, Halloween kits. Um, Simply Watercolor Co. came out is with a couple of really pretty fall kits. Um, those are the two off the top of my head. Oh, um, what is it? Blackbeard Prints. Oh, she's got such beautiful kits. I want all of her kits. Oops. I wish I could have them all. They're so pretty. I kind of put some of these full boxes down crookedly. Okay, and then we'll do our ombre heart checklist in the middle, and I think I want to do actually the blue, the darkest blue one in the middle. Okay, and then we'll work our way out from there. I hear little Liam grunting and everything over there. He might be waking up. I just fed him. Or maybe he's just making noises. So today was a better day. One of our better days as far as um, the kids and everything. I'm still adjusting to um, hmm. oh yeah. I'm still adjusting to being a mom of two, trying to balance housework and taking care of the kids been tricky but uh, one thing that has helped is meal planning meal planning has helped a lot um, because I don't have time to think about oh what do I want to do for dinner tonight <sighs> so that's helped a lot um, what else has helped a lot I guess just trying to keep trying to keep organized as best as possible. Um, like the living room, we just got our carpets cleaned and so we had to move everything out and it actually has helped me to see what I want to get rid of. And so that has helped a lot. Um, the living room is pretty clear and clean. And um, so, that has helped with cleanup, or with picking up things at the end of the day. You know, you can, I try to pick up things during the day, but it doesn't really make a difference because it just gets dirty again, or not dirty, but messy. So, because of my toddler, I swear she makes the mess for like two or three kids. All right, so let's put today headers down and then we'll go day by day. 
So yeah, uh, doesn't sound like she's asleep yet. <laughs> she usually goes to bed around 2. I put her down a little bit earlier because she was falling asleep in the car when we were coming home today. Um, so I figured, I waited a little while after we got home so she can kind of play. And then, um, then I decided to put her down while Liam was sleeping so that I could get this in and do this. And that's another thing that's helped is having a schedule, somewhat of a schedule for the toddler. And so that's helped me be able to take care of the newborn more because obviously he requires just as much attention as the toddler even though he doesn't do anything. Um, he doesn't run around, he doesn't make a mess, but he just requires a lot of time, so, um, yeah. Like I said, it's finding that balance. Okay, so, I have my personal planner here to go off of for what we're doing next week, and, um, actually, I didn't even, that's actually not going to help. <laughs> Let's figure out what to do for dinners. I used up all the dinner stickers when I did um, my personal plan with me. So I'm not sure what to do. I want to film a personal plan with me on Monday. So let's put... TV sticker down here. Okay, and then I'll put a little planner on top of there. And then what else? We have to put out our trash. So. This one kind of looks like a trash can. It's a laundry basket, but it'll work. I have to put out our trash. And then what else? Hmm. That might be it. We'll go on to Tuesday. Tuesday is trash day, so we'll mark that. And then what else? What else? What else? Not quite sure. Oh, Monday, there's a dinner, I forgot. So we'll do a half box. Mm. Let me see if I can pull this up. Okay. There, that looks good. So my dinner, and then I'll put this date night sticker, but I'm pretty sure we'll be bringing the kids with us, so put it like that. Oh, it's cute. So Tuesday's trash day. I don't know about anything else going on on Tuesday, so I might put, let's see if she has a to clean list or something like that. I don't know, we'll just leave it for now. And then Wednesday, I want to, um, my video will probably go live. So we'll put another TV sticker. And then,
I'm gonna put this daily chore sticker with with this cleaning bottle. Okay. Thursday the 25th. Um I film. So let's get that little things back. I'll do this and then I'll put down that big Playing With Me sticker. We'll put it down here. And then there's a bigger planner sticker, so I'm going to put that here. Alright, I totally hate my camera because it doesn't tell me, it doesn't make any indication of it shutting off on you. <sighs> So, I am so sorry guys, it probably cut off early on in the video, but don't worry, I'll go over it again because um, I don't have many plans, so it's not like you missed much, but still, it's so annoying. I hate it. I don't know what to do about that. I could get a new camera. That is totally crooked. I hate this piece of washi. What is wrong with this? Why won't it go down straight? Okay, okay we're gonna leave it like that because I'm frustrated. I actually don't like this yellow color in the Erin Condren because you can't see the boxes, so you put your stickers down crookedly, and yeah. All right. At least for me, it's hard to see. Okay, that looks really cute. Saturday, I don't have anything. Sunday is church, and my husband's mom's birthday. So we have a birthday, that's fun. We'll put this pretty half box down. And then we'll put, I think there was a diamond over here somewhere. And then I'll put this heart and then this diamond sticker that she's got. There. Okay. So there's that. I'm going to work on the sidebar now. So I think I might try to use this washi as my full box, so we'll see how this works. Okay. Okay, it doesn't look too, too bad. We'll put a habit tracker, we'll put a drink up sticker actually. All right, and okay, so I have one on my heart checklist left, so I'll use that. 
Let me see what kind of other headers she might have. She might not. No. Alright, so... Well, she did have another full box. Shoot. I might try to change this. Just because I would rather not have a whole ton of washi down. Because I can see the lines. Maybe on video, you might not be able to see it as much, but... I see it and I want to avoid it if I can. So, I'm sorry if I'm bugging any of you guys pulling all these stickers up and not making up my mind. All right, there. I'm happy with that and we're gonna pull this up. and put it down again. There, all right, I'm happy. <laughs> I will stop messing with things. Okay, so let's put down a piece of washi. And we'll put to-dos, to-do header, I mean. And then we'll put this ombre heart checklist down after that. Okay, awesome. And then I'm gonna put another piece of washi down. I don't know if I'll put another header down, but just to take up some space, we'll do that. And then I'm gonna do a check list here um, I think I might put a half box down here and I'll just put some washi behind it so we'll do this and this Oh, I wanted to ask you guys, uh, I don't know if I want this half box, if you can recommend any Netflix shows. I am a total, um, like I don't go, I don't see anything that I haven't seen before. Like I don't um, wa start watching new shows that I've never heard of before or like ones that I have no idea what it's about, like, I just, if I go on Netflix, I'm gonna watch something that I've already watched before, so, I just finished up Gil Gilmore Girls for, like, the fourth time, now, granted, the fourth time over a span of maybe two years, <laughs> so, like, that's my go-to, Friends is my go-to, Parenthood is my go-to, um, if I'm with my, watching with my husband, House is our go-to, or White Collar, or bones um that's just a few but otherwise i don't i just love it like i don't get sick of the the shows that i watch it's it's awesome because i've never had anything like that and so maybe if i find um some you know some other show that i love that much then i will definitely add that to my regimen because I'd love to expand my, um, I don't know, my favorite TV shows. Like, I'd be happy to if I found the right one. Oh, uh, what else? I was obsessed with Vampire Diaries for a while. I still go back and watch it sometimes. But I have to be in a certain mood. I feel like when I discovered Vampire Diaries, um, so it was when my husband was either deployed or gone for um, a few months. So he was he was gone a long time for sure, 
and um, I think I was maybe like deep down de maybe depressed a little bit not like majorly but definitely you know sad and Vampire Diaries is definitely a dark darker show it's one of the more I feel like the more glamorous shows as far as vampires but um and yeah so I feel like when I'm in a certain mood like if it's rainy out or gloomy I definitely like shows like the vampire diaries I don't know why it's just weird it's you know just a certain thing about it and then with Gilmore Girls if I'm looking for something just homey feel good kind of thing then I go to Gilmore Girls and I mean, it's just something that I can have on in the background, and um, I just really, really enjoy it. It makes me feel good on, like, from the inside out. It it's, sounds weird, but it's true. It's like, if I want something to feel good, and something that is very relatable to me as a mom, or something like that, then Gilmore Girls is my go-to. Parenthood, <laughs> Parenthood, I go, I go to that if like, I don't know. I'm not sure when I go to Parenthood, but it's a little bit more stressful than Gilmore Girls. Gilmore Girls is not stressful at all to me. It really isn't. And I've seen Parenthood a couple of times just like Gilmore Girls and um, Parenthood is a little more stressful than Gilmore Girls, and so maybe that's why Gilmore Girls is my number one go-to, is because it's not stressful, but it's still homey, family-oriented. Parenthood is very family-oriented, I love it. But yeah, so that's my little spiel. So um, I gave you guys a few examples of the shows that I like, so if you have any recommendations based on my current likes, then I'd be happy to hear them. Okay, so here is the spread in full. I really, really love this. This turned out really, really nice. Now, like I said, it, it was a boring week, so I didn't have much to put down from Monday through Sunday, but Monday, I want to film my personal plan with me. We have to put out the trash, and we have a dinner to go to. I put date night, but we'll most likely have to take the kids. Tuesday is trash day, so that's what that is. Wednesday, I'm going to put my personal plan with me live. Um, I put this daily chore sticker because most likely I'll be cleaning something. Thursday, I film my main plan with me and my Erin Condren. Friday is our nephew's birthday, so that's what that is. Friday, shop Jessica Hearts, restocks her things and maybe new releases. Um, and then I put our, my weekend banner down. And then a half box because it's my mother-in-law's birthday. And then um, for my sidebar, you saw that. I found another full box, so that was great. I put a hydrate sticker, a to-do header with the, my last checklist. And then I put a piece of washi down. I didn't put another header down, but um, just to take up some space. And then I put another checklist. I probably will put this, um, make this for dinners. And then just to take up space, I put another half box down there. And then I use my sweet quiet designs. Uh, date covers. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I'm going to fill this out off camera and um, I can probably show you guys afterwards so I'll be right back. Alright guys so I filled everything out to the best of my abilities and so I put my dinners down here. Um, I do meal plan, so I've already meal planned next week's dinners, breakfasts, and lunches. Um, let me know if you guys are interested in a video where I show you how I meal plan or what I do. Um, because I know I like watching videos like that, so let me know if you're the same way, if you meal plan or not, and if you'd like to see a video on that. Um, so I filled that out. I don't have anything in my to-do section because I feel like things come up like the day before or day of and I like to fill that out when I know I need to do something or if I need to get something I write it down there um, and there's my plan with me it's the birthdays so yeah 
that is everything i hope you guys enjoyed this video um be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe to see my future videos let me show you real quick what i have left from this mystery kit here's one of the functional stickers here's the little freebie here was the bottom washi page here are more hydrate stickers checklists little things here was some full boxes and headers here is a full page of washi more functional here was all the headers and half boxes and then here's my date covers from sweet quiet design all right so that is it for now and i will see you guys next time bye